Uh, second of all, uh, I want to address something that I think is very interesting about uh, the American people in general. Uh, in addition to the fact that they're willing to go along, uh, they're willing to believe in uh, certain kinds of numerology, like the 911. Oh, yeah, and this false Nostradamus crap that's passing around all over the planet. Yeah, that's yeah, sickening. I was going to bring up, too, is the, the Nostradamus. Yeah, it's sickening. It's all phony. It's lies. They, they'll pick up any rumor and without ever checking or, or even trying to find out if there's any truth in it, they just pass it on. This spreads like wildfire among the ignorant, stupid sheeple. And they're usually also connected with ufology, New Age movement crap, and all of this paranormal stuff, and I'll guarantee you that a lot of them uh, call Miss Cleo on a regular basis. And they are staunch listeners to Art Bullshit Bell. That's right. Uh, and the funny thing is when you... Or, or they're patrons of the American Patriot Facts Network and some of those other stupid things. The, uh, the thing that I wanted to say, though, is that when you present them with actual... Uh, the actual numerology of this um, and uh, the actual symbolism of all this, they refuse to believe it. Uh, no, no, they don't want to believe they, See, they're in la-la land. They're in, they're in woo-woo, woo-woo. That's, that's what they're all about. They, they listen to Alex Jones. They listen to Art Bell. Uh, they read books like The Montauk Project, which is the biggest bullshit lie crap thing I've ever heard in my life, and they believe it. Mm-hmm. They believe it. And, and if you can... You know, if you can come along with proof that it's not true, they believe in the Philadelphia Project. They listen to Al Bielik, and they just almost worship him, a guy that's supposed to have died twice and been reborn in other bodies, and he was in the uh, Philadelphia Project and got trapped, uh, you know, in a time warp. And um, These people are sick. You just don't understand how sick they are. That's so, right. so don't pay any attention to them. I quit paying attention to them a long time ago. Well, it's just, it's one of those things that you, you run up against. Just you know, don't, when, when you run up against them, take a turn and get away from them and go to somebody who's sane and try to help them. Because you're never going to help these people because they're beyond help. 